Okay, today we're gonna show you how to make a rubber hose coupling out of a piece of ordinary steel tubing. First we're gonna measure our line for how long we want the coupling. We're gonna cut it off. So we'll deburr the line. I'm going to be using a flare force to put the flare on this line today, but we can use a regular flaring tool. What we're going to do is we're going to use the first step of the flare, which would be a bubble flare. I'm going to put a bump on one side, and we're going to turn it around and do the exact same thing to the other side. This would be our completed union. We're going to take and insert this into a rubber hose. We're going to install two clamps. Another thing when installing clamps, don't over tighten the clamps. If the hose is squeezing through the grooves, it is too tight. You can use this method to join hose to hose. Like so, you can use this method to join a hose to a steel line on a vehicle, such as a transmission cooler line, fuel line, anything low pressure, power steering return line. The reason for the bump in the line is to keep the hose from sliding off. If you do not put a bump in the line, the hose will come off every time.